hello guys in this video i will show you how to design primers using primer 3 plus and i will assume that you know how to get the sequence of any gene using different genome browsers but if you don't know i will recommend you to watch my earlier videos on how to get the sequence of any gene using uh, a gene bank or ucsc genome browser and I will provide the link for those videos in the description of this video. So I have the sequence of exon 2 of MEF2B gene and I want to design primers for it. But before doing this, let me give you some tips for primer designing. Primers are short nucleic acid sequence which provides starting point for DNA synthesis. And primer should be should always be designed in 5 to 3 prime direction. The optimum length for primer is 18 to 25 base pairs and primer should have at least 40 to 60 percent GC content. And the melting temperature sh uh, for a primer sh should be between 55 to 65 degrees Celsius. The difference between the melting points of both primers should not be more than 5 degrees Celsius. And the last tip is that make sure that there are at least two G or C bases which are also known as GC clamp in the last five bases at the three prime end of the primer. So these were some tips uh, to design primers. So let's start primer designing. Open your browser and search primer 3 plus. Okay, so click on this first link which is primer 3 plus as i have the sequence for gene i will copy this sequence and paste to paste here okay so there are few options here you can search uh, like this these symbols are used to ex exclude a region these symbols are used for target region these curly brackets are used to include region and clear so i have the i have already selected my region which uh, using square brackets which is this one so this is my target uh, target region and i want uh, to design primers outside this region so this was uh, a simple trick you now you just click on this pick primers to design primers okay so here are our primers this one is our first left primer and its length melting temperature is 62 60.2 and as I have already told you, the melting temperature should be between 55 to 60, uh, 65. So its melting temperature is also good. GC con which is also good. And so the second primer, uh, reverse primer, minimum length for a primer is 18 to 25. And its melting temperature is 60.1 which is very cl close to 60.2 so and its GC content is 50% so I think this primer is these pri uh, pair of primers is good but here are few other primers you can try and select any of the primers so this is our pair 2 its length melting temperature everything is given here so and this first uh, forward primer is attached here okay and the reverse primer 
will be attached here okay you can try any of the primer which you want so there are five different pair of primers so this was all about how to design primers uh, thank you for watching